hi look at her she's gorgeous look at that almost past the boobas anyway so welcome back to another video today's video is a collective thrift haul because for the times that i've been gone in between videos here and there i've done some depop shopping i've done some thrifting as we know and like little things here and there depop ebay you name it i was there also because it's just like it's fun finding these unique pieces i know that if i went to like forever 21 or something i probably wouldn't find that so yeah let's get started I think I want to start off with like Depop or eBay finds. Nothing is truly organized though, so I don't know what I'm talking about. The first thing we're going to talk about here is this corset top. It reminds me of Trip NYC kind of. I know I bought this a while ago, but it was inspired by that Trip NYC drop. The thing about this is that it's a little loose and then also there's like cups here, which I hate this. I've taken this out of all my bras besides the ones where you can't, can't with the padding. It's like, just stop, just, just stop. Are you doing that that's the only thing i don't love about this is that the padding and then it's also a little bit big i have to usually get extra small i have yet to actually style it with anything as goes many of these pieces and the depop shop that i got it from should be somewhere on the screen so this next piece i don't believe i've showed you this but it's like a knitted little sweater that ties in the front it's brown tan there's a little bit of green in there it's in blue it's just it's so amazing i wish it was just a tiny bit larger it's just like kind of fitted but not really i wish it was either like an oversized fit or a smaller fit it's pretty it's very unique i got it from a depop shop that i believe i mentioned in one of my last shopping hauls i haven't worn this yet because i feel that if i wear it i don't want to wear it under like a coat but i want to show it off which is exactly why i have to get some coats that are like good coats which i really want this trip nyc one that's very old but i can't find it anywhere this next piece is a is a bcbg zip up i believe i said that right and i mainly got it because it's kind of like a cropped fit also has the double zip you know we can zip from the bottom zip from the top and i love double zip sweaters um the only thing i don't love about it is that it doesn't have a hood and it's kind of just like a turtleneck fit i also love the designs on it like the skulls and i don't know exactly what you call all these other little things on it kind of reminds me of those like antique vases and stuff that you see i think i would have also still got this if it was in black red or something or in maybe blue those are my favorite colors by the way and green it also has different types of stitching on it it looks like somebody went in and just like did some extra work to it but it's cool so recently we just saw this in my last video these are some capris that i got i still have yet to try anything on that i got from my second thrift trip i'm honestly kind of surprised that i got them i don't want the spandex like waistline i don't know just not really a big fan of it but i mainly think i got it because i love pockets like these i talked about this before but i usually, i love like cargo pants and carpenter jeans because they always come with like the extra pocket right here and i just love that like we just love it we love the extra pocket space we have pockets in the back here and i love how they zip but if i don't love them then we're either gonna get back to Goodwill or we're gonna sell it. This is one of my favorite items from the thrifting that I just did. These are some green capris that I got and they're Kavi, I think that's how you say the brand. And as we talked about with the last pants, a pair of pants that has a lot of pockets is like check one for me. <laughs> and that's another reason why I got these. I also love how they, there's a string on the inside of the pants. It's green. We have the nice stitching on the side here. I feel like they would go really good if I had those like either white, tan, or green pair of moon boots. These would be perfect. Moving on. This next sweater is something that Kendall from like years and years ago would have had. She probably did have something like this, but maybe it wasn't brown. But like these buttons bring me back. My grandmother and my mother used to dress me up. I probably have a photo somewhere with me wearing something like this. I know I definitely had like one that was oranges and yellows and blues and that was like very long that had buttons like this. But I love this sweater. I was like, wow, this just reminds me of <laughs> being like five and having a wardrobe full of stuff like this. But honestly, this is still an amazing sweater. And the only thing that throws me off from it is the itchy material because the slightest weird feelings on my skin are just like one singular piece of hair just like brushing against my skin or like the hairs on my skin like blowing in the wind Ugh, I, like ugh. it makes me do that but because it's like a big sweater and it's happening like all over my arms i guess it kind of like cancels it out because it's just happening like everywhere and not in like one singular spot this next pair of pants these are like 
some low-waisted sort of cargos that I got. These are also another one of my favorite pairs of pants from this thrift. And the thing is, these are old navy pants. They're so cute and like, you know, we have the pockets in the back that are real pockets, by the way. And I love this belt loop in the back, this double belt and how it's so thick. In the thrift store, these look a little bit tan, but now they're green. They're very much close to the green of the other capris that I was talking about, but these are like a lighter green. Once again, I don't really love you know the elastic part but i think another thing that attracted me was the stitching and then like the, the tie and then like the button detail on the leg now these pants these pants the pants that we have no choice but to get rid of because they're bell bottoms why would you do that to me why would you do that like they don't really look like bell bottoms from afar okay they're just like straight pants but then you put them on and they're a bell bottom like, such a waste, such a waste. Now this piece, I don't really know if I'm gonna wear it myself. I liked it when I was in the thrift store and I was like, oh, that's kind of cute. It's like a knitted top with like a cami underneath. And I've seen so many outfit shirts like this, but I think the fact that it's more fitted than it is loose on me, because it's a small, I think that's why I don't like it. It's also a three fourth sleeve, three quarter sleeve, um, which I love three quarter sleeves. Just not for me, not for me. And um, then the second to last thing, these are also some like capri shorts, but they're petite 10, so I don't know if these are gonna fit me like that. They may be very low on the waist, but sometimes we like very low like pants or shorts. It just gives a nice look, you know? But we also have, you know, pockets here, pockets here, but we're very similar to the other capris that I have. I think I mainly picked these up because I wouldn't know if those were gonna fit me or not. And these are like a backup pair, except they're not the same. And the last thing is this very cute bag here. I love it. Look at her. She can be crossbody or she can just be on one shoulder. And I think I mainly got her because of the belt adjustment here on the side. And then also she's very compact for the fact that she has like a lot going on inside and like all these extra zippers on the side to expand the bag. And I just loved it. And I also love how the stitching isn't just black and white, but it's like, you know, this black, it's like puffer jacket quality. That's what I got at the thrift. And what's so surprising is that I got all this stuff from the Goodwill store that's near me. Usually I don't go to that thrift store because every time I go, I find like two things and that's it. But I found a lot of stuff. And I think it's because I always avoid the pants at the thrift store, like no matter what thrift store I go to. This time I didn't found a lot of good pants. I didn't really find that many shirts, which is so surprising. <laughs> but I think it's because I had a bunch of pants so that by the time I was done with pants, I was like, do I really need to look at the shirts? Um, but yeah. That's all for today. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Like, subscribe, check out some other videos. Tell me what else you want to see because there is like 3.24k of you and I don't know what to do half the time. Which is another reason why I don't upload because I'd be like, oh my god. Um, but yeah, leave some comments, some suggestions. I love reading comments. Yeah, that's it. Check out my social medias, mainly just like YouTube and Instagram, that's it. See you in my next video. Peace out, because I haven't done this in a while.